In this video, we'll give you an overview of the entire test scoring process. The first step is to create the test. Next, select a form that works well for your test. Administer the test to your students. Now you're ready to score the tests. Create a key using a blank test form, the same form that you gave to your students. Mark your scoring options in the key marking row. Don't miss the separate video on marking the key with test scoring options. In this example, we'll mark the 5 bubble to mark it as the key, and we'll mark the 2 bubble to score the tests with the correct alpha answer. Complete the key by marking all of the correct answers. Next, press Start on the test scoring machine. The screen displays Feed Answer Key. Go ahead and feed the key like this. The test scoring machine prints the total number of questions at the bottom. Next, feed the tests one at a time. As you score each test, the screen displays the current score and the running average. As you can see here, incorrect answers are marked with an alpha character indicating the correct answer, and at the bottom is the student's score. When you're done scoring tests, you can feed an item analysis form. The item analysis form shows the number of forms scored, the class average, and student performance for each question. Continue feeding each side until you have data for every question. Let's take a closer look. Here you can see that 10 forms were scored. The class average was 86. And you can see how many students got each question wrong. So there you have it. That's an overview of the test scoring process. For more detailed information, check out some of the other videos on the specifics. We'll see you next time.